you start off with that pillar of Islam, what is it? Salah, the prayer. You start off with that pillar, you offer the compulsory, obligatory three units of Salatul Maghrib, the Maghrib prayer, and then you sit again and you're calling out to Allah again. You raise your hands again. You say, oh Allah, accept what I just did in terms of acts of worship. What did you do? I'll tell you what you did. You stayed away from things that are otherwise permissible. I mean, what you started eating and drinking is something halal. It's permissible. It was always halal. But when Allah told you not to eat halal through the day, in Ramadan, you didn't. It should make it much easier for you to appreciate the halal when Allah says, now you may eat it. And it should make it even more easier for you to abstain from something haram that you're not supposed to be doing anyway. This is where the discipline comes in. This is why we say fasting brings about discipline, the month of discipline, Ramadan. Because if I could stay away from something permissible, water and drink and so on, food, that's okay. I surely can stay away from that which is prohibited for the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.